You're just ill-prepared. You're ill-prepared. We don't see these things coming. You hook up because you're just attracted to each other, and then you end up in this life, and you, didn't, you had no idea it was coming, you know? This is my life. I live in a house. I have a wife. I have two little girls and two girl cats. And me. <laughs> yeah, that's why I drink right there. <laughs> just me and a house full of girls. Just like I dreamed of when I was a little boy. <laughs> I used to sit alone at night and think to myself, I, I can't wait till I get rid of all my friends and just move into a house filled with girls. <laughs> just a magical place where even the animals are girls. <laughs> Just a home filled with emotion and a hatred of everything I enjoy. <laughs> and you would think from that description that I have a wife and, and two daughters, and you're wrong. I now have three wives. I have three women who bust my balls 24 hours a day. If they hear my car keys, they pop up like meerkats all around the house. From behind the counter and the sofa, where is he going? I don't know, where is he going? <laughs> he didn't tell me he was going out, he didn't tell me either. They follow me out of the house. When are you coming back? Who are you going with? <laughs> the hell happened? I thought I was gonna be like one of those mafia husbands, you know, like you see in the movies, right? The wife comes up, where are you going tonight, honey? What did I tell you about asking about my business? <laughs> That's none of your business, right? And he goes out for like a week and a half, no questions asked. That's how I thought it was gonna go. No, instead I got my little cell phone, my little husband GPS tracking device. <laughs> Gotta give her updates of where I am 24 hours a day. I'm in the supermarket, it's going great. Uh-oh, there's a woman walking this way, what do I do? Oh, uh, this is stupid, I'm just gonna come home. I shouldn't be out by myself. <laughs> I'm gonna get in trouble out here. Now, oh, don't see it coming. And guys, don't see it coming more than women. Because we have no idea about marriage our whole lives. We don't think about it, right? My daughters are already, it's in their brains. They think about marriage. Girls. Think about it. Whether you want to do it or not, it's in your brain. Guys, never. Never. Would you ever hang out when you were little with all your little guy friends? Let's play Mary. <laughs> Let's pretend I just came home from the store and brought all the wrong stuff and you yell at me. <laughs> no, we don't care. We don't care. Even when we're getting married, we don't care. That's why there's Bride Magazine. There's no Groom Magazine. <laughs> What article could be in Groom Magazine? Why you shouldn't stare at the bridesmaid's ass? <laughs> what? Even when it's the most important day of our lives, we don't even wear our own clothes. We rent other man's clothes. <laughs> Here's a pair of pants that someone else threw up on. Is that gonna bother you? No, it's cool. I'll see you on Monday.